Hello everyone, welcome to your science lesson for tonight. This is Rainforest Animals Adaptations Part 2. The learning objective for tonight is for you to become more familiar with rainforest animals' behavioral adaptations. Let's preview from last time. In your previous lesson, you learned that an adaptation was an acquired body part or behavior that helps an organism thrive in its environment. We focused on body parts that helped animals from the rainforest survive in their environment last time. So for tonight, our focus will be on behaviors that help rainforest animals survive in their environment. A behavioral adaptation is what an animal does to survive in its environment. This may include how it moves, how it chooses to attack, how it protects itself, how it problem solves, or how it avoids dangerous situations. Let's see some examples of these behavioral adaptations. We have here a picture of a jaguar baring its teeth. To bear something means to show it. So this jaguar is showing us its teeth to let other animals know that it's willing to use them and so that it is an animal to be feared and perhaps you should try to avoid him. This lizard has decided to play dead and a reason why it might do that is because it might lure its prey that way. If there's an insect it wants to eat and it's playing dead that insect might curiously come a little closer to it and once it's close that lizard may reveal itself as truly not being dead turn itself around and catch that prey these rainforest primates have decided to huddle to come close to one another and they might do this to show that they are part of a group and are willing to defend themselves and they also might decide to huddle if they're feeling a little bit cold because that this will keep them warm this rainforest primate has decided to make a tool to acquire its food it found a twig and decided to use that twig to capture some bugs. Camouflaging is quite popular in the rainforest. So if you're have and to camouflage means to blend into your environment. So if you're having a hard time finding a creature in this picture, that's because it's doing a really good job camouflaging or hiding or blending into its environment. There's a lizard here. You could see its head here. This is its body, which looks very much like the leaves on this twig. And that is intentional. Can you find a creature here? It is also camouflaging. There is a snake here. The color of its surroundings. Animals may use color to camouflage, but they may also try to look like something else. There is a creature here that's trying to look as if it were part of this twig. This is its body. It's an insect. These are its antenna. And this here is its wing that looks very similar to the leaves on this twig.
Can you find the creature here? This is another insect. It is called a walking stick. This is its body and these are its legs. It looks just like the twigs all around. So for an animal that might be looking for an insect to eat, it might just keep on walking by thinking there's nothing but twigs here. Let's review. Behavioral adaptations are what an animal does to survive in its environment. This may include how it moves, attacks, protects itself, problem solves, or how it avoids dangerous situations. Do you think you remember some of the examples we just saw? I hope we, you do. We'll be using these in classroom tomorrow.